I can listen. How are you? Excellent. Today we are going to see how to use present continuous for the future. You already know how to use present continuous. Remember, we use present continuous to talk about activities at the moment of the speaking. For example, I am making this video or you are eating pizza or maybe I am watching this video. But maybe you are asking, uh, teacher, I know how to use present continuous, but I don't know how to use it for the future. Okay, let's see how to use it for that. You will use present continuous for the future to talk about plans or future arrangements. That it means for established plans. Remember, we have three forms, affirmative, negative, and interrogative. For affirmative, we have, they are having a party tomorrow. Negative, they are not having a party tomorrow. Interrogative, are they having a party tomorrow? At this point, maybe you are asking at home, but teacher, uh, how can I know when I have to use present continuous and when I have to use for future? Okay, let's see the examples. If you want to use just present continuous, you have, they are having a party. What it means that the party is at this moment, that it's an action at the moment of the speaking. But for identify for future plans, we add the word tomorrow. What it means that tomorrow I will do it this action, but I will continue doing for a while. Let's see more examples. Affirmative. I am traveling to Europe tomorrow. Negative. I am not traveling to Europe tomorrow. Interrogative. Am I traveling to Europe tomorrow? Congratulations, you learned how to use present continuous for the future. You already know the uses and the three forms with examples. Now it's time to do some practice. Here we have the examples. So please help me at home. The sentence is they space space the verb is eat space pizza tomorrow. Please help me answer at home. This is a negative sentence. The correct answer is they are not eating pizza tomorrow. Next example. You space the bird is play space basketball tomorrow. This is an affirmative sentence. The correct answer is you are playing basketball tomorrow. Let's go for another. What space you the bird is due space tomorrow. This is an interrogative sentence. The correct answer is, what are you doing tomorrow? Next one, she space, the bird is have space a party tomorrow. This is an affirmative sentence. The correct answer is, she is having a party tomorrow. The teacher space, the bird is come space tomorrow to school. This is a negative sentence. The correct answer is the teacher is not coming tomorrow to school. Last example, you can do it. Space, 
you, the verb is play, space, football, tomorrow. This is an interrogative sentence, so the correct answer is Are you playing football tomorrow? Remember, you can use contractions instead of are not, you can use aren't. Or instead of is not, you can use isn't. I hope you have learned this topic and you can use on your missions. Please stay at home, enjoy your family, and thank you for watching this video. See you on the next video.